From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your weather tonight. Hey, good evening, folks, and a good evening I do think is in store for us as we head over the next several hours. Worst case scenario, we pick up a few clouds. That's about it. Maybe not the best for stargazing, but besides that, if you have any dinner plans for tonight, if you're heading a late night out, not doing too shabby, not by any stretch of the imagination. We are a little bit cool as we head through the next several hours and into tomorrow morning. We're talking consistent 40s by the time we're waking up for our Monday. So you might want to bring a jacket as we're heading into work tomorrow, but I think a warming trend will take back over as we head through tomorrow in the next several days. You really kind of see that with the cloud cover. That cloud cover means there's a little more moisture in the area. And check this out. Wind is out of the east by tomorrow morning. It swings back out of the south, so we're getting that warm moist air out of the Gulf of Mexico. And you know what? The temperatures definitely respond to that pretty nicely. We're talking consistent 70s, perhaps near 80 for our highs tomorrow, at least in northwestern Alabama. I think southern middle Tennessee might be a little more suppressed. And also, if this cloud cover is a little more dense, that might actually affect it a couple degrees there, so I'm still keeping it on the lower side there. But still, looking like a fantastic Monday. Definitely no Monday blues here. And we keep that wind out of the south over the next several days. And then that system there, that's what I was keeping an eye on for the rain chances, right? You see it, and you're like, wow, look at all that rain out there in the plains. That must be coming our way, right? Well, that pushes east towards the end of the week, and it just kind of falls apart. So I'm not really seeing much in the way of any rides, but rain chances as we head to the next several days in the Tennessee Valley. I went ahead and lowered those because I'm just not convinced, to be honest with you. Nice warming trend, though. We really hold that through the week. I'm watching midweek and end portions of the week to see if I don't have to raise those just a little bit because we might actually be talking upper 70s near 80 again. By the time we're heading through Wednesday and Thursday there because we stay nice. We stay clear over the next several days. As for tonight, lows consistently near 50, especially in northwestern Alabama along the river. Check this out up here, though. You're talking 45 in Columbia, 45 in Lewisburg. That's what I'm talking about when I say a few miles makes a few degrees of difference. I mean, that's a good five degree spread across the area. Not too bad. I've seen worse spreads, but uh, that's kind of what you expect across the area, especially here in this little climate here. Again, consistent 70s in southern middle Tennessee, I think 80 decent bent in northwestern Alabama and especially in some of the warmer spots across the area but uh, not sure some of us in southern middle Tennessee will be quite so lucky here as we head through today. Warming up nicely over the next couple days as mentioned there's that warming trend and there are some clouds building towards the end of the week as that system does move east I just don't think it's going to yield any rain to be honest with you. I do have some minor rain chances there for the scattered shower possibility but uh, you know to be honest with you I'm just not convinced it'll be much. And I know we have that drought across the area. We'll, yeah, I'll take anything at this point, even just one or two inches of rain. But uh, if you're not minding the drought, I mean, I think we have a pretty nice week in store. That really is the best way to put it.